KS I Can't Lose, that is a very strong title. Um, tell us a bit about what makes KSI and why he can't lose. Uh, well, I guess KSI is just a bundle of things, uh, but I feel it's his determination, hard work, and uh, self-belief that make him what he is today. Awesome. So in Me talking in <laughs> first person. I like it. So in the documentary, we see a glimpse of a more gentle side to you. Mm. Do you did you have any reservations, kind of like showing off a gentle side before such a big fight? Uh, what do you mean? So like you showed off a vulnerable side to yourself, which you know some people felt like they probably had never seen before. Did you have any reservations doing that before you know a boxing match? Um, Why? Well, obviously, it's a documentary, so. Ben, who was filming the whole thing, uh, just filmed everything, like every little part of the lead up to the fight he would film. So uh, it's not like I had any thought like, oh, I want this to be in the dark, I want this in the dark. He just put in everything that needed to be in and uh, it is what it is right now. So. So, um, speaking of losing, Logan Paul has told reporters today that he is dead serious about going into UFC after your fight with him. <laughs> Do you think he stands a chance at all? Uh, if he wants, if he wants, yeah, he's, he's, he used to be a good wrestler, so I don't know, I guess if he can uh, train hard and I don't know, I, I don't think his striking will be up there. I don't think it'll be that good. And I'll, I'll make sure to show him August 25th that he's, striking-wise, is not very good. Okay, so in the run-up to many boxing matches, you see opponents exchanging like some heavy words. Do you, do you have any regrets over the things that you said at the press conference, especially about Chloe and Logan's family? Uh, no, I have no regrets. Uh, everything I said uh, is what I wanted to say when it comes to the mental game. So pretty much, I'm just trying to get in uh, Logan's head. So that's why I said the things I said. So I'm not trying to, because uh, obviously I'm sure Chloe is a lovely person. Uh, I'm sure the dad, as weird as he was, you know, with the videos he does, which are extremely weird, I'm sure he's a nice guy and all this and that, but ultimately it's a fight and I'm trying to do that fighting talk. So, yeah, so I feel like I need to make sure I get in his head for, uh, before the fight, so. It makes the fight easier for me. So. Awesome. One last question. So with the fight coming up yeah. and your documentary release, PewDiePie recently chipped in. I'm sure you heard what he yeah, said yeah, yeah, yeah. about you guys being scumbags and accused you of both being in just for the money. What do you think about that? Is that true? Uh, well, I mean, he <laughs> has no ground to talk at all, at all. He is probably... No, he is the person that ruined a lot of people's lives on YouTube uh, with his comments and... Uh, his whole anti semitism uh, I can't even say the word. But yeah, yeah. So, he, yeah, he didn't help with that. But, you know, each to their own. Each to their own. Like, it's his opinion. I don't really care. <laughs>